Okay, so uh, this is uh, part number two of my CNC uh, machine build. Uh, this is where the part one uh, left off, actually the frame. Uh, what I've been doing so far today is uh, I've been putting on some bearings here, nuts and washers uh, on this, all these plates here. So. And what's special about this particular plate is that you need two washers on there. You see that? Under the nut there, above the nut there is actually two washers. On this one and all the others there's only one. So yeah, that's what I've been doing so far. And also, I needed to put some threads in here because, uh, you know, uh, or else you cannot put any bolts in there. So, what I'm about to do now is actually continue assembling everything uh, to the frame here and see where it's gonna take us actually. Uh, so, yeah, that's cool. slides very easily and this is the bearings for the the belt of course the motor will be sitting right here fastened here and the belt will go down there and around that and around that one right over there so yeah
Okay, so um, I just finished off some things on this plate here. Um, seems uh, seems decent, I think. There's still more to do on this one, but this is pretty much what I'm gonna do for today, actually. And uh, this is the screw that is going in the uh, the Delrin thing there. <coughs> so also I cannot really finish um, the Y axis here because I thought it would be good to buy some uh, kind of like a Loctite uh, to put on these screws here so they will not uh, open themselves. Also, I think actually I'm gonna flip these ones over so I got the nut on this side and the bolt on this side and also put some Loctite on these ones so they don't open themselves. So I don't have any Loctite so I'm gonna buy that tomorrow actually so that's why I'm kind of like stuck with this project right here and I went ahead to this one right here to finish this one as much as possible. So yeah, that's pretty much what it is. And uh, yeah. So that's it guys for this video. Uh, this is, was a short video. Uh, I didn't really got too much done today because uh, I needed to do some other stuff as well. So a couple of hours I've been building this uh, CNC machine here. So there's not much happening in this part too actually. But I did, uh, as I just showed you, finish off the this uh, plate here as much as I can for the day. And uh, tomorrow I'm gonna go ahead and buy some Loctite. I have a little list of uh, things that I need to buy actually. Some uh, hex screws for the adjustment on the Y-axis as well. The height adjustment because on a, you know, a, a screw like this uh like this that is flipped over like this and supposed to adjusting um the bearing against the aluminum profile actually the machine is so close to the to the bench to the table that the head will actually touch and that's not good so hex screws with no material sticking out for adjustment screw that is what I need so I'm also gonna buy that tomorrow and uh, I think that's pretty much it for this video M not much more much more to show you actually uh, you have to stick around for part 3 where I hope that there will be a lot more going on we're gonna mount some uh, aluminum profiles on the y-axis uh, we're gonna finish this one even more I'm not going to go into any details, this is not a building instruction video, it's just a progressing video. So um, if you like this video give it a thumbs up and uh, if you're not a subscriber I would be very happy if you go ahead and click the button down below here that says uh, subscribe and you will get uh, notified about every time I'm uploading a new vi video and all that kind of shit going on. So until next time, take care now, bye bye then.